time for another tinfoil hat club, my friends. And I am here with another theory that I think is going to resonate with you. The Phoenix Suns had the greatest of all time back in the building the other night. Now, I'm not talking about Michael Jordan. I'm not talking about Charles Barkley. I'm not even talking about the fact that Larry Fitzgerald was sitting courtside. No, I'm talking about the purple sunburst uniforms. They were there, they were real, and oh, were they spectacular, right? But why don't they wear them full-time? Everybody loved them. Fans were begging for it. Media members were saying how great they looked on court. And even fellow players in the NBA, not sons, people playing on other teams, had great things to say about them on social media. So why can't we get the burst back full time? That's what the people want. Well, from what I understand, the answer is simple. Mitchell and Ness owns the rights to them. The throwback jersey company owns the rights, and the Suns, the league, and Nike can't go back to them full time without permission from Mitchell and Ness. So why wouldn't you get permission? It seems like it's easy enough. Well, Mitchell and Ness has a great business model where they make money off of these throwbacks and they don't want to lose that. But here's where the conspiracy theory comes in. Earlier this week, Mitchell and Ness sold part of their company to a group that included Devin Booker and Chris Paul. Let's connect the dots. Devin and Booker, Chris Paul, here in Phoenix. Why wouldn't they want the Phoenix Suns to wear these? You've heard Devin Booker rave about these uniforms before. His teammates have too. Now he is money in the game. And guess what? Chris Paul and Devin Booker, you got it. Nike athletes, which means now they're tied in too. So the Suns, Mitchell and Ness, Nike, all in bed together now in terms of the money. And what happens when the money is in favor of something? It happens. So maybe, just maybe, we're going to get to see the sunburst back for good on the Phoenix Suns, and who wouldn't love that? That's another tinfoil hat club. See you next time. (laughs) 